Hi Aries, welcome to Lily Light Tarot. We're going to go ahead and expand on your message, taking a look at something that you need to know at this particular time regarding your current situation. So we're going to go ahead and take a look here. And if you're new to the channel, welcome Aries. I do new readings every week and I do new readings for the new month. So welcome. So happy that you were led to this message. And for my regular and returning subscribers, welcome back. You know, I truly appreciate all of your time, your energy, and your support. It truly means a lot to me. So Aries, as we go ahead and jump in, we're looking at the Hermit being your opening energy, which I think is um, very powerful. Some of you could be currently um, connecting with an Earth sign. Virgo, Hermit is the Virgo. So Aries, you may be having a Virgo coming into your path. But let's get some other clarifiers here. Okay. So let's see. The Hermit, Ace of Pentacles, the Morning, and the Queen of Cups. What's beautiful is with the Hermit and the Ace of Pentacles, you're getting what is coming your way is going to be greater than what you're looking for. Okay, and as this and this the morning here, it's interesting because in this deck you can interpret it however you like. But the way that the energies are showing here is that some of you are going to receive some type of um, communication or information or news in the early morning. So that's how I'm seeing this, especially with what you are looking for, um, because what you have been you know looking for in the dark is coming to light. So what you have been secretly wishing for dreaming about, manifesting, uh, studying, analyzing is coming to the light, okay? So if you've been secretly trying to work on how to start a business, how to create a product, how to move, how to buy something, how to put together something, how to win someone over, you know, um, how to put together a proposal, how to plan a vacation, whatever it is, okay? The hermit represents your deepest desires, the Hermit is showing what you are trying to um, get a deeper understanding of. It could also be your spiritual practice um, as well coming to light. Like you, some of you are maybe coming out and stepping out as um, being proud of, you know, what you are currently practicing or studying or researching. Um, there could be graduations taking place here too, but the Ace of Pentacles, it really expands on a new career or financial opportunity. Some of you are going to be handed an award or be given a, a job offer or be extended some type of business or connection or contract as we see here with the queen of cups she is showing this is going to be some type of um stable you know connection so if we're looking at like new love or new relationships some of you may be meeting up dating during the day, meeting up at a coffee shop. Um, and this person, you're finding that they are, you know, stable. They're not only emotionally stable, but they are stable in their life. There's no drama. There's no, you know, um, yeah, there's just no drama. They're, they're pretty consistent. They, you know, take care of themselves. They have their life in order for the most part where it meets up to, you know, your expectations. Um, so that is coming in here, but also with the Ace of Pentacles, it's showing that some of you are going to find that what is being given to you is going to help your life. It's going to enhance your life. It's going to eliminate stress. It's going to eliminate, um, I wouldn't say drama, but maybe mm, insecurities in, in terms of maybe like your financial state, um, in terms of your dreams or your goals. But with this, it's like, you just need this one chance to really tap into um, a bigger outcome or a bigger potential but let's get some clarifiers here for you Aries let's see what this is all about for Aries let's see what we're looking at getting some clarifiers Oh, wow. Look at that. We see the world in the sun. Yeah. So this one thing is definitely going to change your life. So be prepared. This is coming up as a surprise too. Again, as I see with the morning, it's like a pop-up. <laughs> Some of you may be getting great news. Okay. It could be news regarding something that you didn't expect to happen so soon, but it just, it's coming out of nowhere, coming out of the blue. Now, as we see the world, I see too there may be 
a situation where you are finding that there is a new offer or an opportunity for you to move somewhere for you, your spouse, your loved ones. The roles could be reversed as well. It may be news regarding someone in your life. Again, I'm seeing a, a, an earth sign. So for some of you Aries, you could be connected with a Taurus, a Virgo, or a Capricorn. It could be news f on their behalf or for them. Um, and you're, you know, you're hearing it from their perspective, but it also trickles down and it affects you. But I feel strongly that it's, it's more you. It's more like this is a life-changing event for you directly and personally. And there, this may involve some type of move, change, um, career change, position change. It could be a change in your environment. Maybe also change um, with your family dynamic or the home structure. Bringing in a new birth, bringing in new life. Uh, some of you may be changing your life as well. Again, as we look at the Queen of Cups, she is showing this stability. She is showing um, this solid equal energy okay because look at the water the water around her is very calm it's very soothing it's not turbulent it's not rocky and she is just enjoying her life so whether we look at vacation plans taking place here or you looking to relocate or shift to a different area where it's drama free stress free um, but it also brings you happiness that is going to be taking place here so that is very beautiful. Let me just shift these over for you, Aries. Okay, so we'll just kind of put that over. And then as we open up on this. Okay, speaking of move, look what is popping up. <laughs> we are looking at, can you see this, Aries? Okay, five of pentacles, the chariot. We see king of torches or wand. Two of Pentacles and the Six of Pentacles. There was an extra card that wanted to come out. So we're reading that as well. The Five of Pentacles, some of you, Aries, are in a situation where you know that what you are trying, like where you're, where you're at, you deserve to have more or you're trying to reach for more because you feel like you're not getting what you see. And I, I think it's interesting as this five of pentacles is right diagonal from the ace of pentacles <laughs> and the surrounding is kind of the same, like this bush, this lush area, this greenery, right? It's like she can see all of these coins, but she can't quite touch it. She can't quite reach it. So she feels like she's missing out. I don't want to say it's like FOMO, you know, the fear of missing out, but it's almost like she's like, why can't I get that? Why can't I have that? I can see it. I can see other people getting promoted. I can see other people getting jobs, starting their business, buying a new car, getting a house, getting married. Why can't I, right? It's so it's something like that. It's like you see it so close. It could even be like a puppy. Like, I want this new puppy. <laughs> I want to be a stay-at-home worker, okay? So it's like you see something in your life here, Aries, and you're just like, I. Can, it's so close. It's so close to you. You just need to like move up a little bit more. But watch this. This is interesting. Look at the chariot. With your focused determination, you're like, I'm getting it. <laughs> you're like, I'm going. I I'm going to get those five of pentacles, but I'm going to get something bigger. Okay. Because this chariot is showing that you are going to take control of your life. If you don't, if you're not satisfied with what's going on, this message is showing that you're going to find yourself led to take control. Okay. You're not happy with the money that you're making. You're finding another job. Oh, okay. You feel like you got overlooked for a promotion? Okay. You're applying somewhere else. Oh, okay. So you didn't get this opportunity or you didn't win this situation? All right. Next, you're moving on to the next course, the next obstacle, the next path. You're like moving on. You're, you're going to be like influenced by that power, that force. You're going to feel driven. It's almost like your intuition, your gut is telling you like, I know the way. Let's go. So you're listening. Some of you too may be. Um, I feel like this could be tying in here with this top energy too. Like this, you found the solution or you found this offer or this other prize um, that is coming. I see this too. This ace of pentacles. Now that I look at it, it looks like it's like you found like a treasure, a coin. You know, when you find like a quarter on the ground, you're like, oh my gosh, it's almost like that too. 
So some of you found like a secret passageway. And you're like, oh, you know what? I don't want those five pentacles anymore. I'm going to go the back way. I'm going to find my own way. Because here with the king of torches, this energy is very... Um, this is a very passionate driven energy this king of this king of torches is like an entrepreneur it's a leader they do not they will not give up if anything they inspire other people around them you know this is that coworker that's like <laughs> if they quit everyone else quits <laughs> this is that friend that if they do something all the other friends want to do it too like oh you're traveling to italy yeah i want to come too you know it's almost like that in a positive way it's in a positive way so whatever decisions they make it influences the people around them and their world so you are um you may be you know helping and influencing the people around you whether it's a spouse a loved one maybe your community but you're going to move towards a change that you want to see happen in your life okay you are making sure that is coming into your your reality and here when we see the two of pentacles we see you making that shift so it looks like universe is showing you that be ready because you are making some accommodations in your life you are you know making um arrangements to fit things into your schedule into your path into your time you're looking at your needs you're seeing what's, you know, a priority. How can you make this happen? And what's beautiful, look at this. As we look at the Six of Pentacles, it's showing. The Six of Pentacles is possibly one of my favorite cards because it shows that what you have been um, giving out, you're going to receive. And you know what comes after five, boys and girls? Six. Okay. So right here, you feel like at a loss, but look what's coming. The Six of Pentacles. Okay. So you are going to have more than enough, if not, you know, better. It's a better situation for you. You have enough where you can hold and you can give. And you can help your parents and you can help your, your kids and you can help your loved ones. So some of you are going to be, because this is almost like a hidden blessing. Because you did not, weren't able to physically reach for these stars, it inspired you to... Be led by your own star, your own vision, okay? Your own determination. Had you not encountered this setback, you wouldn't have been or become the person that you're about to become and do the things that you are about to do. But, you know, some things, it's interesting how where life steers us and that's what the chariot is showing. It's amazing how s small situations, small decisions that other people place onto us or that just happen to be and occur will affect our lives forever and it will affect it in a major way and that is what this is showing here um for you aries it's showing be ready because you are coming out <laughs> in the in a winning position but better look at this yeah three of cups and the death card Bye bye the death card is showing that you are putting an end okay you are putting the end to your old life or to an old chapter that just you're letting go. You're detaching. You're separating yourself from. Some of you are also realizing that, you know what, this 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 is not really all that great. Or you're realizing, hmm, I thought that was big time, but what I have is going to be better. So you're putting an end to your old beliefs, your old thinking, possibly old connections too. The death card is showing that uh, there's a big change. A lot of you are changing into becoming someone bigger and better. You're also disconnecting from people that always said that they were going to be there for you or that appear to look like they were, they were helping you, but they really weren't. <laughs> they did not help you. Okay. They did not help give you. You just need that one little boost. You just needed someone to like boost you up and no one was there to help you or at least the people that you thought did not give out that lending hand or could not spare you, you know, a couple dollars, figuratively speaking. So you're like, okay, well, now I don't need, I don't need your help anymore. Now that they're coming to you. Oh, no, no, no. I love you. Come back. Or, oh, no, no, come back. Work for us. I'm sorry I didn't give you that promotion. Um, <laughs> Come back. Well, you know, we see you're doing well with another company. You want to come back? You're like, hmm, nope. So that Six of Pentacles is like, sorry, but not sorry. 
Again, it's enough where you have enough to hold and enough to offer. And the three of cups is showing a victorious energy. It's like, yeah, you can celebrate. Now you are coming up in the come up. You are winning. You're going to be full of gratitude. You are going to have enough for you and your friends and your family. You're picking up the checks. You're paying for dinner. You have that big down deposit. Okay. So good times are rolling in here for you, Aries. I'm so excited. Um, make sure you stay tuned and subscribe for more readings. And if you haven't already, take a look at your April, depending on when you watch this i have your april 2022 reading coming up as well so until then stay well and be blessed